Did you know? How did first century Jews keep time at night? Jews living in the first century CE could use a sundial to track the passing of time on a clear day. However, when clouds blocked the sun or when night fell, they used the clepsydra, or water clock. Besides the Jews, the ancient Egyptians, Persians, Greeks, and Romans also used this device. According to the Jewish Encyclopedia, both the Mishnah and the Talmud mention the clepsydra under various names, perhaps to distinguish different forms and designs, all, however, signifying one thing, namely, the slow escape, literally the stealing away, of the water, drop by drop, which is the meaning of clepsydra in Greek. How did a clepsydra work? Water flowed out of one vessel, through a small hole at the bottom, and into another. An observer could measure the passing of time by noting the water level in either the upper or the lower vessel, both of which could be marked with degrees of measurement. Roman military camps used such clocks to determine the night watches. The changing of the watch was indicated by a trumpet blast. Anyone within earshot would have been aware of when each of the four night watches began and ended.